Good morning. It's the next day. I know that. Oh, it's not that. <laughs> um, I am just drinking my coffee and reading my book for now until I get a little more light and I can do more crafting. Sorry, it's a little low. <sighs> and there is my dog. It is a very, very gloomy day and um, I am just trying to get a little warm with this. But, um, maybe we will go to do some sewing or first a cleaning. I will just clean the floors. <coughs> he wants a chewy. He wants a chewy. Okay, that's enough. Only one because he went to pee pee. So anyway, I will read a little more and then I will maybe clean just what I need to clean for today and do some crafting. Will be great. That's, oh yeah, I'm reading 13 tail. Uh, I begin practically yesterday because I, every time that I'm beginning something happened and I was able to go to page uh, 56 so we'll see how far I go today it's actually it's very catchy and it's, um, it begins kind of slow and then it has things that I really like like this is a person that uh, this girl lives with his, with her family in about the library or bookstore that they have. They don't make a lot of money, just a little, enough. And the father is that kind of collector of books, of very rare books that you can hardly ever find in different places. And that's how they survive because a lot of the people that buy these books know him and contact him for the books that they are looking like, a special editions that you would not find. So it's... Sorry, my dog decided to drink water right now. Cheers. Okay. And um, she received the letter of a famous writer that she never read because she... Uh, it's, I mean, she read, but she'll read different kind of books, more historical books and things like uh, that kind of genre. And so she never read books from this author that sent the letter saying that she wants to tell her <coughs> the truth about her that, and for what she knows and talk with the father, she, this uh, author, uh, the name is Vita Winter or be the winder, I am trying to remember, and um, never tell exactly anything about her. So she talks with the father and they think it's a really great opportunity to for her to go and write the biography of this author. She's going to tell her the truth. I'm in the part that she went to the house of this author is in another estate and um, she's learning things about her. The house is beautiful and everything but is very different to what you will expect, like kind of spooky way and I'm in the way in the point that she met the author and she's learning little things about that. I don't want to say a lot of the, what happened. I'm just giving you an idea of what, how far I'm going and uh, we'll see what happened from there. Like I said, it really intrigued me. I think it's a YA. I don't know if it's a YA book, to be honest. It say that it was number one New York Times bestseller. But we'll see. I will continue reading a little more. I will not have internet today because they're going to improve my fiber optic 
from 1, 5 giga to 10 giga, that's amazing. That also means that in some point they will increase the, <laughs> how much we have to pay. But okay, um, I will see you in a few. 10 in the almost 10 in the morning, and I'm still reading my book. I decided to make my breakfast. Yes, it looks a lot, but it's because I'm doing a high protein uh, diet. And so far in these two weeks is oh, six pounds. It goes so slowly, but it's working good. And that will be good to do a lot of things at home, right? Look at this floor. They go to the rain and then they come. I need to clean this. I spend also extra time helping my husband to pack because he went to fish. He's doing so good. He's finally doing normal life. No more pain. He must still have a big scar in the head, but that is something that we can survive, right? So, okay, coffee. And instead of creamer, I'm using this one. I put just a little of the protein powder, the keto one. Noisy. Okay, let's get my breakfast going. I need to take a picture of your face. <laughs> Are you happy? What? Did you like? Huh? You want more? We'll give another little piece. Okay. Let's see. <laughs> Hello, just arriving from Japan. Today is my day off and I'm planning to do like a weekend vlog. I went to Japan and let me show you what I got. Really didn't get enough of the things that I was looking for. I got this fabric. 
it's like a nail. It's like a sage color. It's really nice. It's very soft, and I think it would be perfect for some nice, more cold weather uh, project. Maybe a little long sleep blouse or something like that. We will see. I need to wash, and I will begin to do something on this one. I really don't have anything for winter and it's time that I work on that and also got some clips I don't know if you can see clips there and all the kind of clips for some and I think Some purple. It looks blue there, but it's purple. Um, Gutterman thread that is for this. It looks blue, but I swear it's purple. And then I got a big green one that will be. It was hard to find it right. With these, I hope it looks nice. And a light gr green for this one. So that is all that I got. Right now, I'm working on another project. Let me show you. Sorry, my hair is a big mess right now. My dog is there making twirling around. So I'm working this fabric that I showed a long time ago that it was in my plans and I'm going to do this one. I already cut all the pieces yesterday. I only made a mistake. <laughs> but you know, it's more like you see a nice fabric. It's upside down. But who cares? It's just to wear at home. And I wanted to finish this project that is was one of my summer projects before I begin the winter one the other project so so far it's things i think it will be a quick sewing project we will see and in that i can go and wash this and buy the lining for other project this one is washed it's ready waiting just for the pattern and we are done so let's work on this one finished the blouse and I think because since I dropped eight pounds so far <laughs> I'm not skinny but it got a little bigger so the next one this is a fabric that is okay I will wear this at home sorry but next time I will do maybe one or two sizes left no maybe only one because I like to have this very uh, seam, like not tied to your body. So you can move, you can do things, and more when you're doing gardening and stuff. So, so far, I'm happy with the blouse. I didn't spend a lot of money on this <laughs> uh, fabric. And I use all that I have. The slips are very simple. Um, maybe the future one I will do with longer sleeves will be different kind of fabric and I can wear on colder days. <sighs> okay, go back to maybe read my book now since this is done. Yeah, let's read the book. Okay, before I begin my reading, I have a big mess. I try to do everything in the same place and I have things to put away so let's put this from neat and
enough there. Clean this. I will uh, read my book. And they begin to work together and they hate each other, but they love each other. You get the idea. Book one was really interesting. I really love the main character Nevada and the mystery is compelling. And the whole thing will say that exists between the romantic pairing is just so good. So I decided to check out book two and I loved it.